Hello again, everybody, and welcome back to A Late Gamer. I am your host, A Late Gamer. So today is an interesting video because it is a late card pack pulls, episode number five. However, my lovely video capturing phone, aka my iPhone, decided to fail me in this video. You will see why in a little bit, but I already filmed most of this. I thought it was a cool video, so I'm uploading it anyway. And if you all enjoy it, please let me know. But my little sister was out thrifting and found these for me. So I about died when I saw this Pokemon tin. Um, I was like, I always tell any of my siblings that when they go out, you know, keep an eye out for anything old Nintendo and, you know, Pokemon related for me because I think they are amazing. So she found this tin. If I remember correctly, the tin was like maybe eight bucks. And she also sent me pictures of this Game Boy Color holder along with these Pokemon cards. I don't know if they were in the same like uh, thrift aisle or whatever. I thought they were really badass looking. The case was actually a dollar, if you can believe that. I about died. I was it was it was pretty beat up when I got it. I washed it twice. Uh, cool fun fact: these are uh, washing machine safe. So I threw them in the washing machine with some OxyClean and for the most part came out amazing. I also tried Gonzo on some of the stains. Uh, if you don't know what Gonzo is, Google it. It's amazing. It gets stains out of just about everything. Um, however, I think the highlighter or Sharpie, whatever was on here, had been on this case for a hot minute. Um, I also looked up how much this case typically goes for. These will sell on eBay anywhere between like $20 and $30. So when she was like, yeah, it was a dollar, I was like, get it for me. Um, I bought a Game Boy Color that you will see here momentarily uh, a few years ago, and I did not have a case for it anyway. So this worked out great. And uh, I was at a half price books and this was the copy of Pokemon Gold that I found at a half price books along with a copy of Pokemon Yellow. So uh, I have two official copies of Pokemon Gold and Yellow, but I also have a full set of replicas because uh, I am not willing to pay full price for some of these old games when you can just get replicas and they do the exact same thing. And, and honestly, for me, it's more of the completionist thing. Um, and I'm like, I don't care if they're replicas. It's for me. I'm not reselling them. So I just like finding these things. And uh, she got these Pokemon cards for me. It was like seven bucks for this entire stack of cards. And I had this cool transition and everything. And I started going through them. And then I think my dog was in the other room causing problems. <laughs> and so I stopped recording and I came back and started recording again. But for whatever reason, my phone decided to corrupt the file. And so I, you'll see here in a second, I get through a couple of Pokemon cards. And for whatever reason, the file did not work. So you will see them here in a stack. Um, ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be it for this card pack pulls video. However, I hope you enjoyed this quick little Pokemon video. Cool little fun things. Let me know what you think in the comments below. I love you all. I will catch you all in the next one. Peace.